Hello, my name is Kevin and this is the Dimmy Channel. Uh, this video is one that I was not really wanting to do at all. Uh, this is the Biffle and the uh, the ghosty kind of uh, incident with the flower bed. <clears throat> um, I was looking at um, stuff that was on this same video but earlier incidents and somebody um, on, on my channel was asking about this incident, etc. And I'd already made up my mind about what happened on this. <clears throat> um, so going backwards and forwards, we, um, or well, I decided that uh, I would go and have a better look at it. And uh, it then transpired that, yeah, I'm going to end up doing this little video. Now it's not going to be anything special. Um, and I haven't got the golden answer. But I've got a good theory. Um, it's not <laughs> not going to be a popular one, but um, we'll go through it and we'll, we'll see what, how it goes. So uh, I'm not going to do any editing. It's just going to be a one take thing. Um, I don't want to spend too much time on this one, but here we go. So I've put a line down through the center of the compass. This is before, and we'll be working a lot with the compass uh, on this one. It gives us a good information. I'm using Biffle's cheats against him on this one um, to try and show or prove where the guy is throughout. So let's get on with it. Oh, hang on. Let's just pause because I need to put that on slow speed. So I'll try to this stuff. This is a good start, Kev. Where are we? 13 kills. Right, this is the incident. Right, <clears throat> okay. Ignore this bit for a moment, but it does just give you an example of uh, how his cheats are working. It is coming up very shortly. I do apologise, guys. I'm not going to talk about all this stuff because um, that's part of my, another video. Um, right, this is the incident now. Okay, so these double arrows are pointing to the enemy in question. There's another guy who's up, up this end. Uh, his teammate is uh, dealing with him. Okay, so this is the guy, if you look at the, the mini map, this is our target guy, and that's him here on the compass. So when he swings, you can see he swings through, and then he gets back onto this guy, and that's him down there. Okay, so he's got his side lock. We're all familiar with that by now. So he's just along here behind these pillar, this pillar. And this is why I say we're working with the uh, compass a lot. That's going to help us in a moment to identify where the guy is. Okay, so he's directly in line at the moment. When a shot hits him, that diamond will come back up again. So it's back up again now. You can see he's actually locked, locked onto the guy. But that's what's important. Okay, so the guy, did you notice that little jump that's just happened? That's because he's just jumped out the window. Could you hear the glass breaking? Okay, so the glass is broken. So if we look at the mini map you can see that same jump occurs he's now jumped out the window here footsteps which is on concrete so this is that our target guy and that's where he is so he's jumped out of one of the side windows out of this restaurant part or whatever it is around the back here and we'll see where that is. Now, his cheats have just bounced off the guy's body. 
which is so his body is just in line it should be visible but he's it's just in this kind of area here that's it the guy's foot line and this is where his cheats are putting him he Biffle cannot see him but he still fires anyway okay so that's the one that everybody's familiar with where the bullets go off here that's actually one bullet um, you see that a lot where it, it's probably between the difference in frames uh, the frames being shown etc but you'll see that they they actually joined up probably on the next frame or two so yeah now according to that it hits this concrete I don't believe it does <clears throat> um, uh, people from the old days will remember that the bullets came out of your head and not out of the gun that was a visual addition where the bullets appear to come out of your gun but in reality this way you can get people um, off head glitches etc I believe the bullet still comes out of your head and I believe it went down there and if we look at our compass this is our guy that we've been fighting okay so he's over here somewhere there okay so he's now on him exactly the compass is saying that's where the guy is the minimap is saying that's where the guy is but he's not visible on Biffle's screen it's like the ultimate um, those other shots were going nowhere um, it's, it's like the ultimate um, breaking of the camera the guy was there according to the compass and uh, sorry the compass up here and the minimap and his cheats all put the guy here but he's not visible bearing in mind the guy was moving and we've just come around this corner really quick so is this a case of the ultimate camera break so we'll go on so the guy has now moved along that wall okay the, the wall is about here um, you've got the, the the pillars so here he is here that you can see got the pillars here and he's just running along by those pillars down along that side exactly where we just had uh, the lock on him okay so we go forwards okay so the guy is just slightly faded but he's here he's just beyond this corner and that's him there so we can ignore all that bit there the bullet that went across there I think is just a, a, a visual glitch right so see if we can work out where he is he's now here okay uh, it's slightly faded up there but that's where Biffle's cheats have put him so they're doing their side lock so he's he's behind this pillar and he's moving towards this building so see if we can get another little swing on it right we heard the breaking glass and that was this window along here that one there that's the broken glass so the guys come out through here and he's come along these pillars it actually looks like he's come all the way out we heard three footsteps that could easily put him onto this grass or he could have come out and immediately turned that's what we don't know but the compass um, uh, and the, the, uh, the, the mini map put him coming along this grass line and so did uh, Biffle's cheats just that he was not visible on Biffle's client so we we'll move forward right so the guy has now reached this point here in this building that's what the cheats are telling us he swings off him right just here another break in the glass so let's see where that was okay so the cheats are putting the guy just here it's to the side of this it's just here so the window that was broken is opposite this window that we can see here so the guy has clearly got to this corner 
I pointed that out earlier, gone through this door, gone through the building, along to a window opposite this one, and he's jumped out. We've heard the breaking glass and the cheats were put in there. So we'll move on. So he's now moving. This is still followed the guy. He's now moved to this point here. And he's working his way across. He's now lost him. He's lost him opposite hit this one. Right, so he's lost him there. See the way that, that, that does a, a lot faster movement there. He's lost that track. So the guy, if we go back slightly, has got to the end of this building before we've lost him on the other side of this building. So let's just go back. So that's the door. One, two, three. So it's the doorway and three windows. So the guy is at, at that point. See the way that, that bounces there? The guy is on the other side of this building over here. So he's off him. He's lost him now. Right, so we've got one window, which is to our door, another window, a third window, and a full, th th that fourth window. So that would equate to three windows on this side that we just had, okay, which is where the cheats put him as he was going out that window, moving this way. And we can now see him up this ladder. So as I was saying at each point, that would put the guy running around this corner. So the guy's jumped out the window and he's come across here around this corner. And as we were coming into the building, he's worked his way up here. And he's got to cross up there. See the way this is locking onto the side. See? That's how I was able to say where he was. Right, so the guy's here. He's there. He's there. And here he comes. And did you notice again, it starts at the side until he's shooting. And as soon as he starts shooting, he's directly below him through, through the center mass. That's how these cheats work. <clears throat> okay, so. Stops the shooting, comes out of the box, gets back on the side of him. So let's go all the way back to where we were. And we'll just go through all that again. So we've been able to track where this guy's route was. The only issue is where the mini map puts him, where the compass puts him, and where um, Biffle's cheats put him, he wasn't visible. Because they all put him here. So I'll just go back and try and pick up that signal again. That's the sig his signal there. So we're going forwards again. So he's just outside. It's now faded off, but it put him just here, not at the pine tree. It's put him along here because this is where um, the foot line is going to be. <laughs> and then he swings, he gets the hit. The guy's moved down and he's behind these pillars about to go around that corner. Swings across, breaking glass, three footsteps. Here's your broken window. So three footsteps would put him on the grass, but it could have been three footsteps down the pillar. But the compass put him about when we, we were looking at it, it was about there, just below this line, about there. So the compass and the mini map and his cheats all put him, the three things all put him about there. About opposite this window here. He now gets the breaking glass, 
It's on this third window from the door, which is fourth window on the other side. That's the breaking glass. He's on it, and the guy's jumped through. He's now catching him as he's running through. So he's got down. So he's, if we imagine, you know, this is 3D. Um, he's kind of opposite this corner at the moment. Swings back. He's, I think, that's where he's getting around the wall. Okay, so we can definitely get him through that window there. He's come across this car park, probably around the car park, possibly, um, or just across here. He's got to that corner, that's on the far right here, and he's ran. By the time we got through the building, he's got to here. Because he's quite far down as we came in there. Big swing, gets the side lock. Right, so we know that the, the cheats are in action all the way through this. It's now skipped to the other side as the guy's run and, and uh, Biffle's done his little movement. So it's now on his other side. As he takes the shot, it'll go on to centre body. Okay, that's all, all part of his cheats. We know his cheats are active. And that's how we've been able to track where he is. And the guy's finished. <clears throat> Let's see if he, if he got plated up. Yeah, so the guy had got plated up. That's how it appears to me. Okay, guys. So, I'm yeah. sorry I'm not able to... Um, uh, explain any more than that i think there's a camera glitch i think i've located where he should have been on view but he wasn't the compass said where he should have been um and the minimap said and also the way that his cheats work we can work out where people are um and they all say where he was around about that that, that third fourth window down on that uh, along that pathway but he, he just wasn't getting drawn on Biffle's climb. So possibly the ultimate example of uh, camera breaking. My name's Kev, this has been the Dimmy Channel, and thanks for watching.